Good evening, friends. Good evening. Good evening. That's why we know how it does. How are you doing? Come on, come on, have a seat. Welcome, this is our coffee break with the pastors. So, we have been receiving questions from you. So now is the time to set these questions free, to know the answers of all these questions. So we have our guest from India. She's Snigda and we welcome her. So if you want to know more, and if you want to uh, know the answers of all these questions, just be with us. Thank you. Hi friends. Good evening, Pastor. Uh, I'm very glad to meet you once again. So, my friends have so many questions about relationship. So, I, I have picked up some questions for you to tell the answers to everyone also. So, is uh, why does the church doesn't encourage relationship? If boyfriend and girlfriend is forbidden, what uh, forbidden in the church, what do I call the person I'm in relationship with? What do we have this rule about dating in the church? And the question is that the relationship is going not much of the, the rules. Kink. Yes, and we are now in this uh, time when as a church, we need to think how to help to the youth people have a good relationship in the eyes of God. Definitely, if the relationship has a goal to be uh, in the light, the end of this relationship must be a covenant, a wedding covenant. This is the goal of each relationship among men and women. But if this is not the goal, but only to pass some good time, to play with the feelings of another person. In this case, definitely, we're speaking about something that is incorrect, and we cannot support this relationship. But as a church, we definitely are thinking to change some rules, to, to change some positions, with the goal to help the youth build a strong and healthy relationship. Thank you, Pastor. And my second question is, are we supposed to be actively looking, looking for a spouse or wait for God to bring a spouse for us? No, my wife is. Um, ли я активно искать себе партнёра или ждать, пока Бог его приведёт? я думаю, что прежде всего важно мне стать целостным, мне жить так, чтобы мне не было одиноко, чтобы мне не был активный поиск партнёра, потому что мне так одиноко что вот я сейчас очень нуждаюсь в партнёре, потому что он восполнит все мои нужды, он заполнит всю мою пустоту. Нет, нет, нет. Я не должна искать партнёра, пока мне не будет самому хорошо, самому с собой. Я счастлив, и я могу дарить счастье. И в это время я практикую свою дружбу с противоположным полом. Мне нравится. Я уделяю своё внимание, своё почтение, своё уважение, свою дружбу. И в это время обязательно ты найдёшь этого человека. Thank you. I think my friends also got the answers. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Christina. Thank you.